I don't know about you, but I know of at least five or six people that have been injured by this medical treatment, shall we say. Uh, I know one story in particular, very personal to me. The lady that took both shots, uh, I tried to discuss with them and, and tried to, to show them a lot of the things that I had found, the medical studies and the dangers of them and all that, and, and they wouldn't listen. So they went and got the first shot and everything seemed to be okay. And of course, what is it, three weeks later or whatever, they go get the second one. Everything seemed to be okay. But within days, within days, the wife, the lady, she started to, uh, not quite there, her, her mind wasn't quite there. Um, a blueberry was a strawberry. Uh, she couldn't complete sentences. Um, it, it, and, and, and progressively over uh, a couple of weeks and all, it, it started to get worse and all. And uh, she couldn't walk anymore. She uh, didn't want to get up. She, uh, she had comorbidities. No doubt about that. But in, in, in just just a month and a half to two months, she wasn't there anymore. She was gone. Apparently she started having many strokes. They put her on hospice. Nobody wanted her to die alone in the hospital. So they kept her home. She died. Was it related to the vaccine? I can't prove that. But I suspect it was. I suspect she's a victim of this genocide. Just the first of many that are coming. I know people that, that uh, will not take another one. They took two and, and their legs are messed up. They've had strokes since. I pray that I'm wrong, but there's gonna be death and destruction across this nation like you've never seen. I pray that you're strong. I pray that you know Jesus Christ. I pray that it wasn't your mom. <laughs>